Look. At this. Closer. The aluminum can. It seems so ordinary. So simple. It isn't. The can has a secret history. A strange beginning. The can is a necessity. A technology. An icon. And a cultural artifact. Even an object of desire. And it all begins here. Within the Earth. Hang on tight. It's an epic journey. The can will never seem ordinary again. The perfect container. A quest for both man and nature. The nut. The fruit. And the egg. All of them excellent containers. But that doesn't mean that they don't have their own limitations. But breaking, cracking, and shattering is half the container's job. An impenetrable container is useless. You have to be able to get out what you put in it. Behold, half an ounce of engineering perfection. The can. The simple can. An invention that changed civilization. Pretty much all you need is fire and a can, and you can pretty much have any meal of the day. Put a thing of corn, pop the top off it, put it over a, put it over a flame, and you just eat out of the can. The great thing about cans is that they're accessible sculptures. They're meant to be held. They're meant to be played with. They're meant to be crushed. They're meant to be thrown away. They're meant to be saved and put on a shelf somewhere. Cans are really one of the most um, highly manufactured products in existence. It's pretty damn perfect. So the miracle of the can continues. The modern supermarket would not be the same without the can. The can changed our lives, the way we shopped, cooked, and ate. The can is the result of decades of relentless invention. Thousands of patents have transformed this into this. The can is as highly engineered as this or this. Precisely designed, not a single milligram of wasted material. Efficient, cheap and mass-produced on a mind-boggling scale. The aluminum can is among the most ubiquitous man-made products on the planet. Across the globe, we make 220 billion cans a year, 600 million cans a day, 400,000 cans every minute. That's a rate so fast that if we were to stack them end to end, they would reach the moon in under a week. And in six years, all the way to the sun. The perfect container. Perfect because of one thing. Aluminum. Light and strong. The ideal metal. Except for this fact. In nature, there is no pure aluminum. It only exists as part of a rock. The story of the can begins here in a bauxite mine in the wild west of the Australian outback. Aluminum is the most plentiful metal in the Earth's crust. And it is hidden within these rocks, tightly bound to oxygen, silicon, and a whole mess of other impurities. Extracting the pure, shiny metal will be an epic task. The demand for bauxite is voracious. These specially designed trucks, as tall as a two-story house, must haul and dump 154 million pounds per day. 58,000 pounds per minute. Over 3 million pounds an hour. 
seven days a week. A relentless onslaught of stone. But at current rates of extraction, all the bauxite deposits here will be gone in about 80 years.